Welcome to the Wisdom Mastermind. Today we'll be solving a problem from two perspectives, a Zen monk and a Stoic philosopher. And today the question is, how do I stop being so attached to the outcome of my actions? This quote speaks to the core of a timeless struggle. It says that true freedom is not found in getting everything we want, but in controlling our desires. A powerful idea, but how do we actually do it? Think about it, friend. What do you crave? What do you want to control? What is your attachment to an outcome? Tell me, what do you think of this problem and how each of you would approach this question? Friend, this is a common human struggle. We crave control, we yearn for desired outcomes, and when we don't get them, frustration and despair can take hold. As Epictetus reminds us, the key to freedom lies not in the pursuit of external things, but in our internal state. We can't control what happens to us, but we can control how we react. Remember, friend, happiness is not a destination, but a way of life. We must cultivate acceptance of what is beyond our control, finding contentment in the present moment. We can practice this by focusing on what we can control, our own thoughts, actions, and judgments. Like the Stoics taught, we must align our desires with what is truly within our power and understand that the pursuit of external things can often lead to disappointment. Ah, friend, this is a question that has echoed through the ages. The attachment to outcomes, the desire for control, is a root of much suffering. We cling to expectations, and when they don't materialize, we feel pain. This is the illusion of separation, the belief that we are separate from the flow of life. The path to liberation, friend, is to let go, to embrace the impermanence of all things. This does not mean giving up, but rather surrendering to the unknown. It is in the acceptance of what is, in the stillness of non-attachment, that we find true peace. Like a drop of water merging with the ocean, we let go of our individual desires and become one with the vastness of existence. This is the essence of the Tao, the way, the path to liberation. Like, share, and subscribe for more daily wisdom. Thank you. Stoistika.